In this video we share Medjugorje visionary Vitska on Our Lady's first messages. I want to share the conversation that Our Lady had with the visionaries on the fifth day of her apparitions, June 28, 1981. The simple interchanges between the children and Our Lady are very interesting. Our Lady spoke to them simply and with no extra words at all. She wanted them to remember what she said, and fix it firmly in their memory, so that her words would guide them. Here is what was said. The following comes from Sunday, June 28, 1981. The visionaries, what do you wish? That people believe and persevere in the faith. Vitska asks, what do you expect from the priests? That they remain strong in the faith and that they help you. Why don't you appear to everyone in church? Lest are they who believe without having seen. Will you come back? Yes, to the same place. Do you prefer prayer or singing? Our Lady responds, both, praying and singing. Vitska asks, what do you wish from the crowd which has gathered here? The visionary said this question received no response except for a glance filled with love, and Our Lady's smile. Then Our Lady disappeared. The visionaries prayed so that she might return because she had not said, Goodbye, my angels. During their song, You are all beautiful, Our Lady reappears. Vitska asks, Dear Gosper, what do you expect of this people? She repeated the question three times and finally was given this answer. That those who do not see believe as those who see. Vitska asks Our Lady, Will you leave us a sign so that people believe that we are not liars or comedians? No other response, but only a smile, of Our Lady. Go in the peace of God, she said, as she disappeared. What really struck me was the answer Our Lady gave when asked why the people do not see her as the visionaries do, blessed are they who believe without having seen. Doesn't her answer sound like it came directly from the Beatitudes in Matthew's Gospel? So simple and short, and enigmatic. In the Beatitudes, Jesus wanted us to realize that getting what we want on earth is not always the best thing for us. In fact it is our response of faith that makes every situation in our life good for us. It is our faith in God's love, even when we are deprived that will bless us. Please support my channel by liking, sharing and subscribing. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.